why is the girl developing? Hold on, as you should. Hold on, as you should. I do it. You know you ride it right. What is up, J Squad? It's your girl Jayla, baby. Hold on, as you should. As you guys can tell by the title, um, I'm here to, you know, express my feelings and tell you guys how I. And basically, um, I'll be guys. I'll be telling you guys how I feel. So, those who don't know me know that my brother and my dad passed away in January. Um, their death, like, you know, took control on me a lot. Um, sometimes I don't really know how to cope with it. Like, next minute I'm happy, then I'm sad, then I'm upset. Um, so I'm just, you know, really trying to figure out how to deal with it. Because um, it's hard, like, that's my older brother, you know, that's my dad. Um, so I really don't know what to do. Um, at first, I was really upset at my dad because it's like, as a father, and when you have a child, you know, you should be, you should want more for your kid and like, you know, oh, thank you. I'll be back. Hello, J Squad, I'm back. Um, um, after that other video, the last video, I kind of didn't want to finish because it was just too much. But I know I have to. Um, it's really a hard subject because, like, like I miss them. Like, you know, I feel like I was very close to my brother a lot. I really was. Like, I counted on him. Like, he supported my family. Like, you know, my mom is there. Like, my mom supports us. Yes, she does. But ain't nothing like an older brother, you know, and like a father. And I feel like there's certain stuff that. You know, he didn't even get to see me turn 21 yet. Yeah, like, you know, I'm driving now. Like, and that's stuff that we talked about forever. And, like, sometimes I wish uh, I had a kid. Like, at least they would have met their uncle and their grandfather. Like, it's so hard. Like, nobody understands. And like, I don't want nobody thinking this is fake cause this ain't, I don't do that. Like that's weird, like that's weird stuff. Like I'm not coming over here for the views cause I don't give a, I don't give a damn about it, I don't. Um, I'm not coming on here for y'all to feel bad or whatever the case is cause whatever doesn't hurt me makes me stronger. No, not even like, cause this is hurting and it's making me stronger my day like people say it gets easy but it doesn't because at the end of the day when you love somebody and you really care about them i don't really know you don't really know how to feel like sometimes hold on let's see this coming up Like, I would never fully understand why, you know, this happened. And I know, I'm not believe. I believe in the Lord. So I feel like everything happens for a reason. I mean, I don't know the reason now, but I know the Lord's going to show me the reason. And he helped my family a lot. He helped me a lot. Like, I'm still hurt regardless, but, like, since then, it's been... Um, eight months since he's been gone and it's hard but I know that eventually hopefully it'll get easier and um, yeah like that's why I've been dealing with it and like I said in my last video like I just feel like maybe had my dad you know was doing what he's supposed to be doing and being a dad, I mean, I wouldn't say he wasn't a dad, but had he led my brother to the right stuff and been more level-headed, like if 
my brother's doing this and he want to do this like as a father he'd be like no we, we shouldn't do that like that made no sense like let's do this let's move this way let's move that way in that sense then maybe he still would have been here i can't really say because then again stuff everything happens for a reason so i can't really say but and i'm not gonna say and try to blame everything on my dad because james he has his wrongs too he's grown He's 25, like, he knows what he's doing, he's not stupid, he's smart as hell, like, he knows what he's doing, and he had some, you know, wrong in that situation too, but, like, I just feel like, maybe if, I don't even know, like, Maybe if, yeah, like, I don't know. Just don't know. I just want to let you guys know what was going on because I haven't been posting in a while. Like, even back, like, a few weeks ago, I think it was a month ago, I posted and I was still going through this. But, you know, I haven't been really active on YouTube. So I wanted to post something um, for you guys and like it's hard it's so hard trying to be happy for everybody else and trying to not you know be sad for other people when deep down inside I am I'm sad as, I'm sad as hell like I feel like I get my moments when like, I'm like really depressed but like I try not to talk about it because then it makes people around you, you know, not want to be around you or, you know, jealous to depressing and all the other stuff. So, and I'm not the one to open a table. Like, I don't, I don't like doing that. This is hard. But I know. Figure it out. And um, I just want to let you guys know because y'all been with me since day one. And y'all deserve to know what's going on. Like, when I said I did YouTube, when I, when I made this channel and I said I wanted to do YouTube, this is what it is. Raw, like, I'm giving to you guys. However, and this is what's been going on. And y'all deserve to know why. And that's why uh, whoever rock with me, rock with me. If you don't, you don't. You can't really force me. But that's what I'm going through. I'm still dealing with it. It's hard. But I know I can get through it. So, yeah. That's it.